whole crew did it. It wasn't me, it was the whole crew. It may have been the whole crew behind this nearly impossible mission back in 2009, but it was Jason Oglesby who dangled from a crane and pulled Patty Ralph Mealy to safety. Her boat had capsized along the Des Moines River. Her husband died, she was saved, and the whole world heard about it. You can't help but remember that picture. And now people are remembering Oglesby, who died just this week. Humble and hardworking, the two words used most to describe him. That's the kind of workers we need. As we're, uh, as you can see, we're starting to build another bridge right here in this area, and uh, we need workers like Jason. Robert Kramer is co-president of Kramer & Associates, the construction company Oglesby was working for that day. He says Oglesby hasn't worked for them for a couple of years because of his struggle with addiction. But his own struggles didn't stop him from helping others through their own. For him to go and do what he did, to risk his life, to put himself out there, um, he really should have had everything he ever wanted in life. Emily Price covered the story that day for KCCI. She says he was hesitant to take credit. I hope that deep down he knew he was a hero. I really hope that because he was. And now those closest to him are left with this memory, a scene symbolic of the kind of person he was. It's almost like a picture of uh, all of us who are kind of got some sort of trouble. And here comes Jason, you know, to kind of pull you out of the water and, you know, and save you.